For years, Chromebooks and printers have suffered a very painful relationship, but over the past couple of years, things have changed quite a bit, and today we want to show you just how easy it is to set up a wireless printer and print from your Chromebook. If you've been around Chrome OS as long as we have, you're probably familiar with Google Cloud Print. Uh, this was Google's attempt to kind of make their own protocol for wireless printing. And while it was a okay attempt, the problem was most manufacturers didn't get on board and it was near impossible to walk through a Best Buy and find a device that was Google Cloud Print compatible. A lot of users had to spend time researching, finding a printer that worked or you ended up just using another laptop to act as a go-between as a server for printing just so you could print with your Chromebook. Thankfully, those days are gone. Uh, printing on Chrome OS has come a long way. Now, Google Cloud Print will officially be dead in two days. Uh, it dies on December 31st, 2020. Uh, and that's left a lot of users worried about what are they gonna do about printing. But like I said, things have changed a lot and it's a lot easier to print with a Chromebook now than it used to be. Uh, we have an HP Envy Pro printer right here, and, and we've long recommended HP printers because thanks to HP's Chrome plugin, most of their all-in-one printers that you find at Best Buy or Target or Walmart just work with Chromebooks. You install the uh, plugin for Chrome and it sees the printer once it's hooked up to the Wi-Fi network and they just work. They even uh, give you USB compatibility and you can use the web browser to scan with these devices. Uh, but as Chrome OS matures and more manufacturers include themselves inside the Chromium repositories, printing's gotten even easier. Uh, many devices just show up in Chrome OS once you have them set up on your Wi-Fi. And that's what we're gonna do today. Uh, we're gonna set up this HP Envy Pro 6445 using an Android phone and the HP Smart app and show you just how simple it is to set up a wireless home printer and use it with your Chromebook. As I mentioned, guys, uh, Chrome, Chrome OS and printing have come a long way. That doesn't mean it's perfect. The chances are decent that you may have a printer that still doesn't play well with your Chromebook. And there are printers out on the market today that are new that may not work without a, a little bit of effort on your part. But many of the all-in-one printers that you buy from Walmart, Best Buy, Target, wherever, if they're called all-in-ones and they're, they're consumer wireless printers, they're just going to work. All it takes is you setting the device up on your Wi-Fi network for your Chromebook to just see it the same way any other computer would. And the best part is there's no installation of drivers or anything like that on the Chromebook end. You just set it up on the Wi-Fi. The Chromebook sees it and it just works. So we have this HP Envy Pro 6455 here. Uh, it's a little bit on the higher end for a consumer model, but I've tested this with uh, $39 HP printers. Uh, they have 3000 series, 2000 series, you name it. They just work. So what you're gonna do is on your Android or iOS device, you're going to find the HP Smart app in the App Store, download it, install it, and then once you fire it up, you're gonna see add your first printer here. You're gonna to wanna to make sure your device is connected to the Wi-Fi that you want to use for your printer, and then click your add your first printer. It's gonna search for any devices that may already be set up. Uh, but if you click add printer here, you're gonna see the HP Pro 6400 is in setup mode and it's ready to go. So we're just going to click into that. It's gonna confirm your Wi-Fi. So go ahead and put in your Wi-Fi password, click continue. Then it's gonna go through the setup process of pairing it with your Wi-Fi. And depending on which one you have, it may prompt you to press some buttons on the machine. But once it does that, it'll go through the setup process and in just a couple of minutes, your printer will be connected to the Wi-Fi and ready to use. And there you go. In under a minute, the HP printer is connected to the Wi-Fi. It's set up and ready to print. Anyone that's connected to that same network is gonna be able to see the printer. It's about as simple as it gets and it's nothing new, but here's the really cool part. All right, so we already had one printer set up on this network, but if you look now, the HP Envy Pro is shows up here and you can click save and it will now be in your saved printers on your Chromebook. So anytime you go to a document, PDF, dot, wh whatever it may be, when you click print, the HP Envy Pro 6400 is going to come up as an option. There are no 
drivers to install. There are no extensions, Chrome apps or anything. The Chromebook just sees it and it can print to it. it. It's so much better than printing's ever been on Chrome OS. And there's been a lot of panic with Google Cloud Print going away at the end of this month. But we're just here to show you that it's so much easier than, than you could have ever imagined. And there's no reason to worry about what you're going to do moving forward here. Uh, again, we recommend HP printers because they just work with Chrome OS. But this works with a lot of printers from Epson, Brother, Canon, and others. Uh, while we can't list them all, I will drop a link down in the video to give you a list of printers that are compatible with the HP Smart app. Because if they are compatible with that app, chances are really good that they're gonna work with your Chromebook. So that's it guys, uh, in under three minutes, we set up an HP printer from scratch and we can print to it from our Chromebook and it doesn't really get much easier than that. So if you like the video guys, give us a thumbs up, uh, hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that notification bell because we've got a lot more how to coming your way. We know a lot of people got new Chromebooks for Christmas and we wanna help you get in there and make the most out of your device. And we'll see you next time.